Each week, Chick-fil-A brings us stories of athletes who inspire us. Tyler Flipson joins us now with a unique football camp run by a San Ramon Valley star. Marco Jones is a junior at San Ramon Valley High and one of the top recruits in the nation. With all he has going on, Marco still took the time to put on a very special football camp this past weekend, leaving his mark on the community. This is the field where Friday night moments are made. But on this special day, it's for the kids at the Marco Jones Skills Camp. A two sports superstar and his family put on a camp for the community, hoping to raise money for a great cause. It's going to Helmets for Helmets, which you know gives um, kids who have epilepsy hel uh, soft helmets in case they fall uh, or hit their head or something like that. So you know protects their head because you know that's the most important thing. So got to protect that brain. And then when I was younger, I had epilepsy, so that's you know that's a big thing. That's a big cause that I love to give back to. The junior is getting lots of help from his family and teammates volunteering with this massive turnout. The fact that like over probably 120, 130 kids are out here. Uh, yeah, Mark is just a big name in the community and it just means something that he's given back to the younger kids, so it's amazing. I mean, it makes me feel really happy just because, like, you know, it shows that I have a lot of support in the, in the community, but also that a lot of people are willing to come out here. You know, it's the first time I'm ever doing this and kind of take a chance on me and just hope that it's a good thing that's going. So I thought it turned out pretty well. Football is no longer just a sport for boys, with interest in flag football taking off for girls. A member for the girls team helping out is a natural for this event. You know, we have uh, Sydney Gann out here too, and she's she's helping out. You know, she's on the on the women's flag football team at our school too. So, you know, I know that it's a boys and girls camp, so it's good to have her helping as well. It's awesome. I, I saw some girls out here, and I was like, it's starting to grow, and that makes me so happy because I get, just get to see this um, sport evolve in uh, many years. I'm hoping I could play, hopefully, in college one day. And it was just awesome when I saw girls out here. I thought it was really cool. The young players are thrilled to be coached by players from the local team. Hard work on three. One, two, three. Right. Let's go. Run over, run over, run over. Good job. Good job, you guys. Keep running fast out there. Good job. Everyone here knows Marco is headed to a major university. Which one is the big question? Yeah, go ahead. Do you have an LSU scholar? I do not, no. Shut up. Go ahead. I want to tell you to go there. You should go. You should go to Oregon. We'll see, we'll see. Marco does have some advice for these young people on their future in sports. Uh, I think just always be yourself and always have fun in what you're doing, right? Like, it's hard for people to not like you if you just stay true to yourself and always do what you enjoy doing. It takes a lot of skill to be a successful football player, but even more to be a successful person. Marco Jones is proving to be both. It's clear Marco is just as amazing of a person as he is an athlete. He really left an impression on those kids. Marco hopes to make this an annual event for the Danville community. Awesome, and it was fun. I was out there. Those kids loved it. Yeah, doing a, doing a great thing. I'm Robert Bronstein. And I'm Aubrey Tolliver. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and check back every Sunday night. And watch us every Sunday night at 6 and 10 p.m. on NBC Sports California. We'll see you at the games.